Hello and welcome back. This is Darius Torana and we are back on Valheim uh, on the Raveguard server. So we've got our artisan table set up here. Um, we don't have any iron for it though. So our plan for today is to head over around where uh, Bone Mass is at because there's the plains right near there. Um, we will take a boat with us over there and we'll raid some villages uh, so pillage some village uh, get some of the uh, whatchamacallit's done my auto pickup must be off or something um, get some uh, iron finished uh get it from the crypts and stuff because there's some crypts around there um basically everything we need is around bone mass so that's what the plan's gonna be um i think what i'm gonna do is there should be a cart around here somewhere that was almost broken i don't know where it went i may have repaired it so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna break this cart down So we have that. Alright, so we'll have a cart. And I'm going to bring enough wood for a... Oh, hey, Christmas tree. Um, Sorry, Yule tree. We're out of wood. Alright. Well, um, I've got some wood in my house, so we'll get enough wood to build a crafting table. And then from there, we will be all good to go. Oh, I upgraded my house's stuff to a cauldron, so that's nice. All right. I believe we are all set and ready to go. So I will go ahead and pause this for now. Once Rave is ready, we will take off. All right, and we are back. So we are ready to go, I think. Yeah, I'm good. All right. I'm still being low on food, but not much to do about that yet. All right, so we're going to Bone Mass, right? Yep. Oh, oh. you caught me uh, decorating the tree. Oh. But I threw out lots of nice presents for us. Nice. That looks really good. Oh, and some mistletoe. Yeah. But no kisses for you. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. I don't like the beard. Yeah. All right. I keep trying to go to the oh the bar to, instead of the temple. We need to bring the boat, right? Or do you have the boat already? Uh, we don't need to bring the boat until we're heading back. Oh, okay. In which case, we're going to want a cart, too. I have a cart with me. Oh, okay. Still might want that for the planes, also. Yeah. I didn't even grab a portal kit. I should have done that. So to the east of us, there is two folding villages that I have marked and a ton of tar pits. There are four unexplored tar pits to the east of us. Sounds good. To the southwest, there's two folding, or a folding village, a folding tower, and a tar pit that I know of. And we haven't explored that area very far. All right. And I'm then gonna... you explored up north, and there's at least one folding tower up there. Sounds good. So, we have lots of options. Right. Sorry, I was just putting some stuff in that chest real quick. Because I realized after I had made my sausage, I forgot to put, like, the thistle and stuff away. Sounds good. Alright, so... Um... Uh... I'm gonna hop back through and grab a portal, because we're gonna want that for taking Tar home. Okay. 
Also, we don't have any fire arrows, and that would be useful against the tar monsters. Gotcha. Okay, so I will be a minute, because I gotta make up some fire arrows. Sound good. I'll go ahead and take the stuff back through then. Okay. Are there secrets in the plains? Like, can I leave my wishbone? You can leave it. I don't think I've ever seen anything in the plains for the wishbone. Okay. Ironically, it seems to just be the meadows and the mountains. Okay. Um, yes. Yeah, I actually kind of like that they call it the, the Yule Tree and all that, because that is actually what I celebrate. I don't actually celebrate Christmas anymore. Oh, yeah? Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. That's part of what drew me to this game so much, is uh, I found it very shortly after I had uh, started following the Norse paganism. So, yeah. I know you followed Norse as a religion yeah i haven't cool. like i've i'm not super duper religious i i am uh i i like to follow things just more spiritually and let it evolve naturally but i've even like carved my own uh mjolnir uh pendant and everything so yeah yeah so that's really cool yeah thing works Traditions are one that I want to learn more about, but I don't really know a huge amount about them. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah. a lot of the stuff is having to be just recreation type things, because mm -hmm. uh, so much of it was vocal. It wasn't written down. Yeah. And so a lot of it was lost. But uh, a lot of people have been working very diligently to recreate it and it's been it's been really good so that's really cool yeah also i found some of your stuff oh well you need some food it was a very heavily damaged wolf over here so i hopped into the cart at my house and i found your helmet and your hammer and I made you some fire arrows. Oh, thank you. Oh, and I picked up the wolf's meat. Sorry, wolf. Oh. It's okay, he will hopefully find it. Yeah. <laughs> ah, there he goes. Okay, and the portal is unconnected. Okay, good to go. Oh, and if we are crossing any of the big plains rocks, we should hack them down, too. Okay. I've got my pickaxe with me, so... Excellent. Okay, I think we should go to the southwest first. Because okay. there's less stuff over there, at least that we know of. And hopefully it'll be less intense of a, a getting started. Sounds good. At some point, we got to beat Bone Mass again so we can get a trophy for in here. Yep. I was thinking about that with motor too. Yep. But we should wait a little bit in game so that we can let the eggs respawn. Yeah. Should I bring the cart with us now or should I wait? Um. Go ahead and wait for now because okay. we can always pop back here pretty easily by portal. Okay. What's that over there? Oh, that is a fully village right there. 
Heck yeah. And the planes rock. Oh, oh, oh. Bad Deskito. Yeah, I was like, I'm pretty sure I just heard a Deskito. <laughs> yeah, I was trying to back away from it when I didn't get my shield out. Okay, he's coming after you. Nailed it. Excellent. Oh, uh, watch out, locks. Uh, you got his attention. Or maybe he's just rummaging about. Yeah. Come on, Loxy. Yeah, yeah, you still hurt even with bow mask. Watch if you bite, you see it really hurts. I think he can get you if you're back by his back leg. Or oh. front leg, I mean. We got fully on us. Oof. Ow. Yep. Ow. Oh. Well, I got that block up or I'd be dead. Yeah, same. Yeah, I need to heal for a second. E2. Oh, and he's going after a blob for us. Hit that blob. Ooh. Nice job. Locks pelt and a locks trophy. Oh, guys. Nice. Have you gotten a locks trophy yet? Yep, there's yes. two of them hanging up that's, in my room. Yep, that's right. I remember now, that. Now, what we do not have is a trophy for that big guy over there. All right. Well, how's your bone mass doing? Uh, my bone mass still has three minutes. Okay. My health is, has like 50 hit points. Okay. But before we take on the big guy, let's start with the sneak attack damage. I'm gonna focus on the little guy. Don't let him hit you with that. I was not in your uh, range for the thing, so I'm gonna try and do some range damage on the Berserker. Okay. I might keep him busy. Oh, ow. That was a lot for being blocking. Okay, back to range damage for me too. We got another pulley come up. Ooh, ow. Yep, but he's down. Come on, give me your head. Ah, no trophy. Okay, we should have some shamming in here somewhere. Don't come inside the building. Don't come inside, okay. Right. Better if only one of us are in here in case we get trapped. Oof. Ah, where he kills me. So watch out for two star foldings. Okay. Eh, I don't actually see any shaman. Nothing good in there. Wax. Yep. That's awesome. There's actually barley at the one at the overlook. So now we've got flax and barley. Nice. 
Technically, I already had some flax because I stole it from the village, but still. One of the villages to the southeast of here. I just hit bow mass, rang and stole some flax and rang out the other side. <laughs> So this was a very small village. Yeah. Alright, well... Ow. Don't stand in the fire. It hadn't spawned in for me yet. I was like, what oh. did you just put there? And then all of a sudden I just got lit on fire. I was like, oh, okay. Oops. Okay, I'm gonna throw out the portal here. Sounds and good. We can hack down this plane's rock and go sleep. I will be right back. Okay. As I forgot what we had talked about with me grabbing those uh, small stamina and health potions. <laughs> Yeah, it hurts. Do you want to? You want to go ahead and sleep and then hack down the plant rock? Sure. Okay. I am coming through. Also, I always keep the small stamina potions on me. It's a good idea. Yeah, it can really be a lifesaver at times, especially if you fall in the water. Yeah. Or if you decide to do some of the stuff I've done before and swim from continent to continent. That sounds exciting. It can be fun. In uh, my last shared world that I played with my brother, we swam from continent to continent over like six continents. And it was crazy how far we got without ever needing a boat. That's awesome. So does that fire stop them from spawning again? No. Uh, when we first came up to the village, the fire was actually burning, but it burnt out because it only had so much fuel. Oh, okay. And time marches on for the rest of the world while we're not here. Gotcha. Yay, my pickaxes are up to 14. I feel like I'm starting all over with my character again because <laughs> my skills are so low. I'm so excited to see this thing break. It's pretty cool. You can always stand back and watch it if you want. I'll probably watch it once we get closer to the end. Mm. Alright. Yep. Two more pieces to break, I'm betting. Ready? Yep. Oh, that was so cool. It did not need two more.
Plains rocks are so useful. Yep, they're great. You can get more out of mining the rocks than the uh, the mountains, but for the amount of effort it takes, plains rocks are amazing. Yeah. Because I don't know how much you put picked up there, but I got almost three stacks. I got roughly that as well. Yeah. That's most of a chest for one rock. Now all we need to do is another like seven of those. And I'll yeah. have all the rocks that I need for my current two projects. <laughs> Alright, are you back through? Yeah. Fighting a death mosquito right now. Ah, I see ya. All right. Okay, and we're up to 13 black metals so far. Nice. Nope. Got to mark that village as being completed. Okay, so we have a plant rock over there across the water. A tar pit at the base of the plains rock to the right. Okay. So. Do I go clear another rock? Yeah. Or take on a tar pit? Let's take on a tar pit. Okay. It's also a mosquito to our right, so I'm going to take it out. Oh. I have pulling to our right. So many cloud berries. Excellent. Actually, it wouldn't hurt to mark the patches of cloud berries. Oh, okay. As mark it as CB. And I don't worry about the number. Because there's always so many of them. Yep. Plus, they tend to get destroyed pretty easily in the plains. Oh, do they? Yeah, if a lock steps on them, it'll destroy them. That kind of sucks. Yeah. Okay. So. Oh, it looks like there's a Fultling village off in the distance over there, too. Oh, yeah. You know, I don't think that's a Fultling village. Oh, it's a falling tower. It's like that one that we stopped on the island for. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, got those fire arrows? Yes, and they are equipped. Excellent. Let me know when you're ready. Okay, just collecting these oh, cloud berries. I got quick. a uh, mosquito over here on my clear out. Okay. Two mosquitoes. And I just watched some locks spawn in, but they're out of range of the fight. Alright. Unless you want to do this the easy way. What's the easy way? Uh, I get those locks' attention and draw them over to the tar pit. And let the locks take out the growth. Ah. Or the growth take out the locks. Either way. I mean, a little help would be remiss. Okay. You might want to uh, stand back. Alright. I'm going to shoot locks, and then it should start coming after me in a moment. There we go. Got into the water locks. Keep going. Oh, we got the gross attention. Time to fight the gross. Falling. If they hit you, your movement will slow to a crawl. I recommend moving side to side when they're shooting at you. Can't 
hit him with my bow. Oh, that's good though. Okay. How are you doing over there? Pretty good. A second one just came up on me, though. Excellent. Come over to help. Yeah, he jumped. Okay, your first one's down. One more. And more mosquitoes. Try to let him come out of the tar before he dies. Okay. Stuff in the tar is stuck in the tar. They so see oh. these uh, black rock looking things. Yeah. Those are more tar that we can harvest. But we can't get it because it's stuck in the tar. That sucks. Well, that's where draining the tar comes into play. I love oh. the person wanting to take out these mosquitoes. How do you drain the tar? With a pickaxe. Oh, okay. Building a pit over there? Yep. Okay. Well, that is perfectly fine. We just gotta build a channel from this pit over to some place where it can drain. Oh, okay. Try to keep it on a gentle slope and not have too many uh, dips. Okay. Or I get caught in the dips. Hmm. Ah, there the two lockers are. Probably good as far as how far to go out. Oh, this far? Yeah, that's probably good. Okay. You want to break the uh, wall leading into the tar pit? Yeah. I'm stuck. Mm-hmm. Don't worry, it just slows you, it doesn't stop ya.
Well, it's her. Harvesting out doing it very well. That looks better. It's a new route. Grab it. Alright, you must have got most of it. I only I got, got 24. I got 90. Nice. Alright. So we head over to this plane's rock and stop the portal? Yeah. I keep hitting the wrong button. Hey, cat, no flying. Sorry. Oh, you're good. Don't worry about digging down underneath the rock or anything. Yeah. That was an accident. <laughs> wow. We certainly get more stone for it, but it's also a lot more work. That's one reason why I like the planes rocks, they're easy. Yeah. Side. Oh, we didn't actually check around the back before we started doing that. Just broke. Yeah, mine's gotta be coming close. Where'd you put the tar? Uh, I stuck it in my house. Okay. Oh, I didn't actually repair my pickaxe. <laughs>
Gotta break up around the side of the big rock. Here? Uh, probably. I can't see you at the moment. Yeah, there's one more spot that looks like it's sticking down by the big rock. Oh, got one star falling. No ambushing him. Get over here. <laughs> oh, he's running away like crazy. Like he's afraid to fight me. How you doing? I'll break it. Well, I'm not sure where. <laughs> so I can't Probably reach right any here. of the areas. I probably broke it. I hit it oh. a couple of times. I think I thought you hit it once too. Okay. Might grab a little bit of wood over here. I don't know what broke this stuff. Oh, there's more black metal over here from somewhere. Well, I feel like the plains is probably a bad place to be at at night. It's definitely not the best, but at least we're not running around. Hopefully this will be the last piece right here. Yep, there we go. Oh, good. Did you run back through? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, good timing. Ow, bad pulling. I just picked up all of the rock, had it all in my overloaded inventory, and got ambushed by three pullings, including a one star with a torch. Oh, jeez. Alright, two down. Gotta wait for the other one to stop running away from me. Ow, that tickled. Okay, all three are down. Okay, coming back through.
You're on that, I assume? Yeah. Excellent. You're running in for mine. Hey, Max. You know, I kind of can't complain because there's, like, no windows in my house. Technically, it's just, like, an open section of the wall. Yeah. But it's annoying that your house is foggy on the inside. Yeah. <laughs> we could use the crystals to make actual windows, but then you can't see out very well. Okay. Oh, did you already collect all the stone? Yep. And took it back through. Okay. That's what I was doing when I got attacked. Gotcha. Alright, we're up to 25 black metal. And my Heck inventory yeah. is very full. Cool. Okay, we got the tower over here. There's a lock next to it and a Deskito. Two Deskitos off this direction. There we go. Okay, let's take care of that locks before we go in there and start attacking. Sounds good. I want a real life box for a cloak. These guys look so fluffy and Yeah, warm. they do. One of the YouTubers I watch for making random stuff made a reindeer uh, fur cloak. Oh, that's cool. And that looks really hot. I have time to do it too, but it's expensive. Hey, there's no pullings up here. I wonder if the, they went after that locks and died. I mean, they could have already come after us. They don't attack the locks. Oh. The pullings keep locks as as pets. So oh. the uh, locks will actually attack you if you're attacking pullings near it. Oh, okay. Yep. Weathering wood. But this is one of those things that I want to be able to unlock the crafting recipes for when you find it. Yeah. Because it would be kind of cool to be able to build in this uh, style of the house. Yeah, it would. I like Especially these, like, flag, copy, brass things. Yeah. That's a deer hide. And that little pedestal that the uh, the caster was on would also be cool. Yeah. Wow, I got that tower marked very accurately. I marked that from a distance. Nice. Okay, I just came up to the top of this hill. We have more stuff over here. Sweet. Holy cow. Yeah. Three tar pits. Uh, it's all one tar pit. Oh, okay. But it's just three individual spots. So there's gotcha. like four or five different ways that they can look. Oh, uh, okay. But we're going to get about the same amount of stuff out of them. Shall we try gotcha. the attempting to lure enemies in to kill the tar monstrosities for us? Yeah. Okay. So let's stay back here on top of the hill. Okay. And I'm just gonna lob a single arrow into the middle of the village. Well, I might have overshot a little bit. There we go. 
Oh, I need to switch my fire, fire arrows. Okay, I think we might be too far away. Okay, I'll circle around and get closer because I can run faster. Okay. Oh, oh. there. There. There, they're spawning. Okay, oh, grow strong. The gross fighting against the uh, berserker. Sounds good. Oh, and the other gross are destroying me. I got Stop two of their me. attentions. Let me get my speed back. Huh? I got two of their attentions, and then I just got a Fultling that now is going in to attack them, I think. All right, I'm coming over to help you. Oh, oh he did not. I see them all. He did not last. Yeah, watch it. You're very close to them. <laughs> very close means a little room to move over. Yeah. This growth is just sitting here waiting for its fire to kill it. Nice. Zerker's going back. To the... Oh, it's still alive? Yeah. That's unfortunate. Ah, I missed. Shoot. Nice job, you got it. Oh, my inventory is full. Oh. He barely took any damage. I don't think he fought for very long. Ah, bad mosquito. Watch it, your bow mass is up. Whoa, hello, Berserker. Them to death with arrows is less exciting, but sure is a lot safer. Yeah. Especially since we are not geared to be fighting him in hand to hand. Use the same tactics I use against trolls. Hit him and run. Just, uh, as he gets close and starts to swing in, that's when I do my actual run. Uh-huh. That was well, huh? Oh, ow. That didn't work as well. Oh! That's me. Nice. Coins and black metal scrap. Ah, still no head. Oh. It's okay. We'll get one eventually. Oh, just in case you run back across tar pits that we've cleared in the past. Yeah. They do respawn monster. Uh, monster. Gross. Gross? Okay. Did you respond to gross? So, it may not be clear the next time you come through. Okay. Alright, I am going to set up the portal.
We should probably be doing this every time before we attack a tar pit or a village. Another Got berserker's coming. In. Oh, there's a second berserker in the village. Hey. Whoa, that's a lot of them. Oh. Yeah, and my health just got very low. I took a hit from the spear pulling and fire pulling. Combat for a minute. Ow. Rude. What? The? Ah. Spear pulling got me. Ah, oh, dang. Alright, I'm the down. Three that were following me. Most of them are heading back towards the village. There's about six more plus the berserker. Jeez. At least we haven't had to worry about shamans yet. Yeah, I haven't even seen one of them. Oh, kind of weird, actually. Usually, when there's those little huts that I ran into in the first village, yeah, there's usually a two or three shaman for that hut. Oh, okay. Ooh, my bow is up to 16. Yay! Woo! Oh, I have pissed off the whole village. <laughs> oh, I see ya. Or I see the berserker. Yeah, the Berserker's on me. Alright. Got the spear full laying down and the... one of the club ones. Excellent. Okay, I got my equipment back on. Out of stamina. Whew. Block the Berserker, but I did not parry him. Berserker down. Oh, I'm out of stamina. <laughs> I walked straight up that pulling down swing and nothing was happening. <laughs> All right, hold still. Hey, we got the Berserker trophy. Yeah. All right, did you get all the uh, Bog Metal scrap from the guys that you killed? I think so. I have 13 right now, so. Excellent. I don't see any laying on the ground at the moment. This village is a lot bigger than the other one we did. Yeah, it is. You can generally judge the size of the village based on the number of huts. And surprisingly... Oh, we got fire pulling. I haven't seen too much in the way of uh, the watchtower guys. I shot one of them. Yeah, the other guy came up behind you. Uh, 
I got barley over here. Oh, I am carrying too much. I got room. I just put some stone in this chest. Okay, I've looted a couple of chests so far, nothing good. Uh, I got, I got over here. I got some black metal scraps, some more needles, and there was one other thing that I don't remember what was in there, but it wasn't anything super was great. A spinning wheel. It was not a spinning wheel. Ah. That's good. Spinning wheels are not important. Okay. We can make one, it takes five stones. Oh. Alright, I think that was everything. Alright, well, head back through because my inventory is very full. Yep, I picked up the stone that you left behind, and we still got to loot this uh, tar pit too. Yep. So I'm going to drop off my black metal scrap and go and start looting. I never thought about it before, but I bet the hoe would be really helpful in dragging tar pits. Because that would make it really easy to flatten out the bottom of the, the trench that we dig. That's true. Cats have been having issues with distributing dominance lately. There's a, a little fight going on. Almost got two full stacks of uh, the black metal scrap already. Mm hmm. Soon as we're going to start needing that uh, cart. And we've got two chests worth of stone already. Yeah, we're already working on our third. Yep. dip back there. Okay. 
I'm hitting the edge of the tar. Okay. Should be ready. Cool. And I will keep on mine. Is it making it all the way down to you? Oh, it's like I stopping right over here. I was watching the top. There we go. Should make it like most of the way to you and then you'll probably get out of range of the tar pit that despawns. Gotcha. Oh look at you being smart. <laughs> I never carry that thing on me, but I really gotta start doing it when we're recording. Like one of my favorite uh head pieces. <laughs> mm-hmm. Wearing it though breaks my set bonus. Oh. I've got increased punching and fire resistance from wearing all three pieces of the armor. Nice. Which I don't care too much about the punching without using flesh ripper, but still. Wait, there's a weapon called flesh ripper? Yeah, it's the Wolverine like cloth. Oh. But we need more silver. Gotcha. And Pangra's hair. And my pickaxe broke. Got the uh, tar pit in the pulling village marked. Okay. Elephant, what are you doing around here? Here, ho. Uh, yes. Oh, you toss it down into the tar. Oh, dang it. Oh, it's okay. Mine over here in the tar will dang. 
Oh, more. Got it. All right. Seven tar this time. Okay. Okay, I got the rest of this. Oh, oh, missing one more piece of stone. Yeah, this thing is really handy. Yeah. Start at the high side and start working your way down. It just forces all the tar to go behind or run away from you. That's awesome. Oh, and if you need bone fragments, so you can break those uh, bone rib cages. Oh, nice. We definitely don't need fragments, though. So. No. <laughs> we got like a chest and a half. Yeah. Alright, and we're over two stacks of black metal. Heck yeah. That means we have four and a half stacks in this area. That's pretty good. Yeah, not bad at all. Gonna go quick when we start working with it, but yeah, still. always does. Yeah. Let's see here, how long have we been recording for? Oh wow, we've been recording for an hour. That's not surprising. We've got a lot of work done. All right, so that's probably a good place to wrap up the episode then. So. Sounds good. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy the episode, please slap a like, subscribe, comment, and all that good stuff. And until next time, keep on surviving. And have fun gaming. Goodbye.